Hey everyone and welcome back to Newport Bay Zoo. We are back in the franchise and today with actually more or less just a quick update and here's the reason why. I'm just going to jump in rather quickly. I think we have to revive this series a little bit and I want you guys to get in a lot more. So what I'm doing, I'm giving away three, 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 one, two, three, not one, not three, not uh, two, whatever, three. Three game codes um, of uh, actually random game codes. I have some, you know, I can give away um, of some small other games. And if you guys want, um, please make sure to go down in the below into the description on the comment section, I should say, and um, let me know what you think we should go on with this zoo. Like uh, which kind of animals you want to see, and if you want to, um, you know, um, kind of double your chances, you can actually give me a blueprint uh, for the next episodes that you have to drop into my Discord and then I would basically double your chances um, of winning one and then in the next episode I'm going to call out the three winners. Um, the reason why I'm doing this is actually to give something away to you obviously but also to give you kind of a reason why to revive this series. So today we are spending just a couple of minutes, not much to be honest, just a little bit, um, fixing this background here a little bit, this backstage area because it looks kind of crampy and kind of boring and bad and so on um, and we don't really fix too much about the animals um simply because wait we are in april i'm gonna save the weather at the time for the moment um water temperature having significant negative effect it's still having this effect there right i think the positioning of this one was pretty dang good though right i i remember something like that that this is wait the radius is still so wait i you know what we do we'll put that somewhere else we have to put it in a way that it is connected here right so you know what we do, we're just gonna put this, um, wait there should be pathway, oh I put something down here, but there's the path, we should be able to maneuver it next to this side, so I'm gonna just, this water is not affected by that one, right, no this is still connected, but wait this is not in here, right, so what about this water, this is not regulated at all, that one isn't regulated at all, I think it's not too big, big of an issue, but um, I think it's fine, so what I'm going to do, I'm just going to bring this thing all the way out here and then we can basically increase the radius a little bit so it touches that one and now what we got to do is oh wait we got to uh, rotate it just quickly and then uh, we're going to put a path in the staff path over here wait why is it getting so big no six meters stay with one meter please let's have a look that we can um excuse me okay so it doesn't work like this but you know what we use our good old uh, trick of making it a three meter path in between um, of the queue, but therefore we just have to make that first and then we're just gonna connect the queue over here and we're just gonna, wait, it's not gonna go here. Oh wait, because of the path, right? Yeah. So that should be already enough. And you know, we're just gonna one further, that should be fine. And then we are going to delete this and I guess we can already connect uh, this and this, awesome. And let's, hey, 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 let me just delete that. Thank you so much. And we're just gonna put the path down here. We can already delete this and connect this bit over here. Awesome, so done. Um, so this does uh, actually help with the negative effect. Is there anything else? Water temperature regulator is inaccessible. Oh, well, I guess, why is this? Wait, can I just put a path down? I, I can't because of this one. Well, is there no way to put a path down? Just no, okay. Well, how about how about placing this thing a little bit different then? Um, I think it was about the radius, right? So this is just for for that water over here. Is it still touching it? Can touch this? Nah, 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 nah. I think it is still touching it. Awesome. Okay, so this is fine. Um, we fixed those two issues. This will go away. Unknown water feeder box. Uh, yeah, this is still a bug in the latest update, so we can basically ignore this. Awesome, and we can say hello to these two people. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. Yeah, I've got no idea what animals we can get next, guys. I'm, I'm a little bit, I'm a little bit stuck to be honest, because like we we put all the aquatic animals in. Um, I want to go further into the South American area, maybe, because we already started having the uh, pygmy hippo on this side. We have the otters here, so we could technically also go more into South America if that makes sense. But I also want to keep this a little bit more like. Uh, yeah, kind of a harbor area. So I, I think it would make sense to plan out a little bit. Let's, okay, let, let's see. How much time do we have? I wanna keep it 10 minutes from now. So what we will do over here is um, 
we're going to put in something rather cool and this is just a <laughs> it's not cool it's just backstage and then we'll take a few minutes to um address the future situation of uh, this zoo which means we are going to look into what we can do with um the stuff given at the moment and uh, you know considering where we want to go so i i have an idea how to do it and we will lay it out and then you guys can comment down below if you like it or not i mean and please if you don't like it let me know and if you have a better idea let me know as well because that helps me figuring out where we want to go by the way if you guys want to catch me live tonight i will be live uh, actually live for longer we are going to start around yeah, I think around um, 8.30 p.m. Central European time, uh, which is around two hours from the moment the video is going to be released. Like, nothing special, nothing crazy, um, so it should be fine. And you guys can hopefully be uh, able to catch it, so that should be good. Um, and yeah, I would be more than happy to welcome you guys over there. Link is in the description, as always, so in case you have no idea what I'm talking about. First of all, why would you? Second of all, ha, don't worry, I'll got you covered. Okay, so what we do now is we're just gonna build this bit over here as, you know, this is going to be like the backside anyways, so just going to make it pretty simple and easy, nothing too crazy. And I'm sorry if I keep it paused, but I, I just want to make sure that we don't run into weather issues right now, um, because it's actually very good to build in these lighting conditions. Um, even though we could make some money, you know what, let's just keep it playing for the moment being. I think that's fine. Um, do we have actually a normal wall available? This should be a normal wall. Okay, good stuff. So let's put this one down and this will be that height. Okay, good stuff. Let's put it down here as well. There's this pathway in. I'm, I'm, I'm fine, I guess, with how it looks. I think it's not too bad. And then we're going to just take these walls, drag them all over here. Yeah, the pathway is sticking out a little bit, though. Um, how are we going to fix this? I think we can fix this in two... Wait, is it not... Oh, this is, this is actually the positioning we need to go. Well, I think the easiest way would be... Oops, no, 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 no. The easiest way would be to just pull that out once further. Can I just rotate it to... Yeah, that's the best positioning here. There you go. Is this connecting to the ground? Um, yeah, well, it's, it's hovering a little bit, so I don't want to have it hovering. I'm just going to bring it down to the ground like this. That should be fine. And then we are going to copy these things over, just making like a bit of a, oops, backstage roof. So, you know, the people can't see it either way. So I'm just going to put this one also to the backside here so that this is just kind of closed off. Yeah, whatever. So this this should be fine. Oops, no, this is not fine. And we also got to put something to the side here. Um, let's see. Okay, 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 okay. It is, which wall is it? It is the normal wooden wall from the aquatic set. So it should be this one, right? Yeah, why is it having the different color though? That should be fine from down there though. I mean, it's not it's not too worrying on my in my perspective. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna copy this further to the back, so it makes a bit more sense. And I'm gonna bring this down, connect this. Lovely, lovely. That looks good. I'm gonna put this wall in here as well. Oops, um, that should be rotated. That is nice. And now we're just gonna pull this one down. And I think we can just keep that a flat roof. Why not? And I, I want to put like a billboard on top if that's a cool like for the future I'm gonna put like an advertisement billboard on top. I think that could be looking very neat indeed um, Which shouldn't be a rhyme, but it's fine Can we do it more often? That would make uh, my Stream more often. I don't know my <laughs> Don't listen to me. Okay. It's it's dangerous. It's kind of dangerous. Um, I, oh, this is I, I thought okay. Well, never mind. I used the corrugated uh, instead of the instead of the wood That's also the reason why it looked so weird. We can also um, Shall we use like another frame? We're gonna go in here. This is where the frames are. So that's fine If we do it that way, I'm just gonna keep it frame There you go, and then I think we can also use the roof piece here. Oh, actually it was already a good height No, that's fine. I'm gonna keep it that way just to make it look somewhat nice, you know, this is fine. And then, I mean, we still need to do some detailing. If you guys want to do some detailing, feel free to do so, like a billboard or something on top. That could be like a cool little challenge. Why not? Um, I like the idea of having that. And now I like the idea of having some roofs, roofy roof on top here. So, some roofies. Um, there you go. 
let's put it up here. It's kind of a flat area. I think in the end, um, this zoo obviously will be connected even more with this central hub area. So once we branch out the zoo a bit more into this direction, we're going to have more zoo stuff over here and we can have some connections. But I think since um, this is now the new hub for this area, this is the new hub for this area, or not, not the new, that's the old one, and we need a new hub for South America. Um, this is what we might need to go to next. Uh, I guess that's a good idea. And yeah, just in general, look at, look at this. I mean, this looks kind of weird because we don't have a real wall here. Can we just, let me just copy this once. Is there, where's the other piece? I should take that one. Okay, good. And now we just bring that in and we just finish this off or like close it off like this. That should be good. And we just copy this one as well. There you go. And I think we will be fine putting all of these things in here as well. Again, you know, this is backstage and we don't need to make it like super good looking. Like it should still look kind of decent in the end. So I will need to change it a little bit here with the pathway as well, because that kind of looks weird if they would bump into it too much. Um, but it's kind of close to it anyway. So I'm just more likely putting some, maybe it would be better to just put some, uh, how they're called again, bins in there. And whenever I can close it totally off, I will put a door in. I think a door would make a lot more sense because that looks a lot better anyway. So with this thing connected here, I mean, maybe we can just relocate that one because else that would look stupid as well, but whatever. So actually, no, you know what? We can actually change the pathway in there a little bit and that should fix the things. Um, we can also just rotate this piece. Oops, that's not nice. Now it's getting dark anyways. We're gonna have to speed through to the next day though. It's cloudy, but it's it's not raining, which is good. What's the what's the weather afterwards? Is that not telling me? No, it's not telling me yet where to go. We've got no forecast. That's bad. That's bad, that's bad, that's bad. Okay, well, this is kind of fine, you know? This is kind of decent. Um, the, the different levels over here look very weird. I think I'm gonna change this next, but got all these doors and stuff. Where is it even connecting? Oh, this is connecting over here, and I, I made this gate. You know what? Oops, how did... How did I need? Oh, okay, this is the animal doors. You know, you know what? We can, we can just put that huge gate in here as well. Wait, can we? Okay, there is not really like a, like an opening thingy, right? Okay, so we can just put that gate in. Why not? We can we can call that the beautification gate. Okay, <laughs> it's not really, but okay. Um, and on that side, uh, we can also on that note, we can. Oh, I like the. F Ooh, this is kind of a neat frame. It looked so good that I really thought it belongs here. And that's a compliment. I think it was Dommel who made that, or was it Andal? I keep forgetting that, but okay. It's not okay, to be honest, but I keep forgetting it. Such a shame. Such a shame. Okay, let's drop this down a little bit. So we have the wall finished. And the same, oops, connect over here. There you go, all done. Okay, last uh, three minutes, we're just going to spend um, in order to find out what we do next. Where's the speed? There you go. Speed it up to three times, making sure it works. See, the, the negative aspect of animals is gone, which is good. Actually, do I have no animal notification? This is still the same issue we have. They keep getting a little issue, but yeah, so we can still do it while it is dark. Um, this is the this is the kind of wooden wooden stuff over here. Animal has escaped. You can. Okay, well, I think that was just a little bug over there, right? Yeah. So what I will do, obviously, I want to keep this thing going around the lake as long as possible. So this is where we branch out into that area. Um, I want to keep that mostly nature. So we will, at some point, just go back into another direction from here. So this is somewhat like how it, I want to make it over here. And then I definitely want to make sure that we go over here into a certain South American area. Oh, wait, what's going on with the pygmy hippos? Who's fighting though? Who is fighting? Okay, you gotta just show them it to me, but where are them? Where are they fighting? Where? You gotta tell me where. Okay, there. We've got two Pygmy Hippos, male, 11 years, and a young one. Uh, you're going to be traded. See you later, alligator. Um, It's actually a Pygmy Hippo, but well, that's fine. Okay, so this is done. And now, yeah, so guys, this is just a, broad, a brief idea, and we're going to try to make this like the South American area, and I need now your feedback what this should be looking like. So 
we have this whole area to the left here we can play with. Shall we go for Jaguar? We are making some decent money, so we could get one Carnivore in. Or what shall we start with? We also have different possibilities, so let me know in the comments down below what you think. And in case you guys want to catch me live, again, here's the little hint. I will be live tonight from like 20.30 um, or like 8.30 p.m. if you will, Central European time on Twitch, the link's in the description as always. And if you like the content on my channel, all the other stuff, make sure to subscribe, that helps me out as well. Keep us growing and you get the notification when I'm live and a new video is there. So, have a good time, stay safe everyone, and I talk to you in the next one. Goodbye.